Venus in the galaxy makes a little with the fish against the sharks to fight. You want to grab yourself a bit, blood? I'm on a bench. Gaffer doesn't think you've got your head in the game with all this transfer business going on. Frankly, I'm inclined to agree. Boss, my head's fine, trust me. Personally, I hope you stay, lad. On the Spurs sub bench today, Alex Hunter not starting. Alan, big news, he looks less than pleased down there, and uh, it's only a matter of time, I think, before he does leave this football club. Might be a chance here, an early goal, and Tottenham are in trouble. Well, you do wonder whether the whole Alex Hunter affair has had an effect on his team here. He's gone in strongly. It's a shot now! There is the second! All right, shambolic at the back. No communication, punished again. It's really toxic in the stadium. Spurs trailing 2-0. They come out to start the second half. Looking for the third goal to finish this off. Well, it had to come. It's 3-0. Well, that really was schoolboy defending. All right, Hunter, it's time. Here's your chance to win him back, lad. I'm not leaving like this. That's the spirit, lad. The fans who used to cheer him are now booing him, him being Alex Hunter, who's being sent on here. And it's not a great time to come on because his team are struggling in the game on the scoreline. They're already down to 10 men, and the crowd are now going to have their say about Alex Hunter and the Real Madrid rumours. Yeah, I mean, it was always going to happen, wasn't it? Part and parcel of the modern game, Alex Hunter would have expected it, especially with his team trailing to this extent. They're going to find it hard to keep him in these circumstances, aren't they? He's not being treated particularly well. Maybe the fans feel he's not treating the club particularly well. Kane! Well, his name is shortened to the point, and so is his style of play. Kane scores. Well, the side with the extra numbers have actually conceded here remarkable yeah maybe a lapse of concentration for them took it a little too easy just a reminder 3-1 it is now the scorer Hog Jurgensen Davidson here's a chance to attack slip through now here is a chance that's going to run on through to the goalkeeper. There's an update from uh, Alan McAnally at the Britannia Stadium. It's the second goal for Everton. 62 minutes played, 2-0. Thank you very much, Alan. Still got a bit to do, but this is promising. Great chance! Hugo Lloris stops it comfortably. Ince. Delivered into the box. Somewhat risky, the defending. Here's Harry Kane. Son. 
Well, it's hard to watch Alex Hunter without thinking about this potential move to Real Madrid and the motives behind it, whether it's the right time for him, whether it will make him or break him. Well, it's a big moment in his life, isn't it? And you'd hope he's getting good advice from his agent and particularly his family, his father and his granddad. Son! Well, that's a goal with class written all over it. It looks wonderful when it comes off, not quite so when he doesn't. And here he was, faced by the goalkeeper. That was the challenge. In you go. Easy as you like. It looks easy, doesn't it? But I can tell you it's not. You have to be at the top of your game to try it and to convert it. Well, plenty of goals here today. 3-2. Jonathan Hogg. Now, here's a good vision. Brilliant puck. He's in here. You really fancied him to score, but the goalkeeper kept his beliefs and kept him out. Yeah, I mean, he'll be asking where his defenders were, but come at the hour, he stepped up there, didn't he, the keeper? Very good distance to the clearance. It's gone out for a throw. Well, that was quickly done. Jonathan Hogg. And they tried to keep it, but they haven't been able to do that. Just read the intentions of the opposition there to make the interception. There's some potential in this move. Able to cut that out with um, some sharp movement. Now he's looking for support. Space for the shot! It was a real opportunity, but there might be a key moment in there from a defensive point of view. Yeah, well, they really did converge on him quickly. He didn't miss by much, but he's missed it. Christian Eriksen. Whitehead. They could post guiding the pass through. Bit of a sprint for the goalkeeper, but he made it. Davidson. Jonathan Hogg. It is coming to the business end of this match, isn't it? And they're still looking for that elusive goal. Yeah, the crowd trying to G up their players, trying to get behind them. Trying to produce a bit better than we've seen so far. Substitution for time. Activity on the bench for the losing team. The substitute getting ready to come on. Victor Waniyama. Hey, he's had a go here. Oh, fantastic goal. My word, this game looked dead and buried. But they didn't think so, just kept on going. Now they're back in it, all square. And they've pulled the rabbit out of a hat here, Alan, because they're level even though they're down to ten. Well, haven't they, Justin? Who knows who the winner will be in this match now? Well, this is what we love about football, a goal fest. And we're getting it in this game in abundance. Still don't know which way this one's going to go with five minutes to go, score still level. Let's go over to Stamford Bridge and Alan McAnally. It's a goal for Manchester City. It's been scored by Sergio Aguero. Very fortunate. The ball came back off the post, hit the sprawling keeper on the back of the head, and then four minutes remain. 2-1. Cheers, Alan. Sark! So a corner to come, and it's still not over yet. There's been plenty of warming up going on, and now I think one of the substitutes will be brought into the game. Hunter. Put him in front. Pull on the frame of the goal. It's Alex Hunter. Oh, how he's made the difference, Alex Hunter. On as a substitute, he's put them in front. Well, it's almost as if this connection to Real Madrid has energised the boy. So lively down there. He looked the goalkeeper in the eyes and said, right. I've got the win here, and he's got the goal to show that. I love that kind of finish when you don't have to blast it as long as the placement is right. We had seemed to be stuck in a, a bit of a sailmate, in truth, but this very, very late goal has changed that. Well, they threw men forward and they've got the reward. But it could lead to the equaliser this late on. They won't have many more chances. He's cut that out well, well read. Can really get at the opposition here. He could cross it now. 
Well, that's a great interception. It could have been a really important pass at this stage. Got on the ball in midfield, well read by the player in that part of the pitch. And there's the last blast on the whistle today. This is a terrific win for them, against the odds, depleted, but certainly not defeated, they've won. Well, yeah, I mean, they all put a shift in, those left on the pitch really worked extraordinarily hard, and in the end it paid.